The largest wind farm built in at once in North America is located in Oklahoma. The Public Service Company of Oklahoma says it will increase renewable energy and save its customers money. News on 6's Chin Doan explains. PSO says the newest wind farm combined with the two others that recently opened in central Oklahoma will save customers about $1 billion over the farm's 30-year lifetime. Public Service Company of Oklahoma and its parent company, American Electric Power, are taking advantage of Oklahoma's winds. The North Central Energy Facilities, made up of these Sundance, Maverick, and Traverse wind farms, are now running in central Oklahoma. The latest, Traverse, which opened last month in Blaine and Custer counties, has 356 turbines. We've won over a lot of people on this one. This, we're going to produce a, an enormous amount of, of jobs, economic activity, and, and ad valorem tax payments. So uh, we're making friends out there. Wayne Green with PSO says some employees who worked at coal plants transitioned to the wind farms. He says the Traverse Wind Farm produces enough energy to power 440,000 homes a day. We're being good stewards of the earth by producing natural energy that does not uh, pollute in, in its creation. At the same time, we're being good stewards of, of our customers' pocketbook, quite frankly. When asked about risks to wildlife, AEP says it follows all laws and works with public and private groups to protect animals, both in its location choices and operations. Chief Operating Officer Lisa Barton says these wind farms are critical in flipping the company's energy mix from 70% fossil fuels to 70% renewable energy by 2031. We are going to sequentially and consistently move to a clean energy economy by harnessing the power of wind and bringing that benefit to our customers. Oklahoma Energy produced for Oklahoma customers. And through the PSO Wind Choice program, customers can buy up to 100% of their power from wind sources. Chindone, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.